from Reese LLC and what I'd like to talk to you today is um, how easy it is to decompile a Android app. Um, first off, let's take a look at the app that we want to um, decompile. We're going to be looking at this Agile and Beyond app and what that is is it's a very basic conference app that we wrote for uh, a conference in March of 2011. So um, what it does is it just has basic session information. So without further ado, let's go and have a look at um, trying to get that off the Android device, which is a droid. So if I open up my command line, uh, if I use Android bridge, bridge to connect to the machine, the machine's been, the device being rooted. I know that the what I'm looking for is in the data slash app folder, which is where most of the APKs are. Uh, we, I can see here that it's, um, it's actually right here. So it's com.reads.agile.agile.beyond.android-1apk. So that's what I'm looking for. So if I get out of here, get out of the device, now I'm back at my desktop. If I use the Android bridge to pull it back again, I'm just going to copy it onto my desktop. Oh, would help if I went to the data folder. Okay, there it is. Let's get out of this. And you can see that it is on the desktop. So now if I run the APK tools, which is uh, a nice little app that puts everything together, um, and then you just right click the mouse click, hit decompile APK. It does back smiling to um, disassemble the files, the DEX files. It runs DEX to jar and it uploads the JD GUI so that you can see the code. So if we go into something very simple, we can see that you have access to the code. Um, there's the speaker, there's the schedule activity. So um, that's just a quick demonstration of how easy it is to download an APK off a device that's been rooted and um, also how easy it is to run APK tools to pop up the source code. Thanks very much. 